Hi, my name is Jeremy and today we'll be learning about distance between the point and the plane. So the distance between the point and the plane it actually means the shortest and the perpendicular distance between the point and the plane. So in this case, say the point is P and the distance is on the, uh, so the plane is here. But we have to find the direction of the vector. And the direction of the vector is similar to the normal which is perpendicular to the plane too. So the normal of the plane, you can get it through the plane equation, which is ax, b, y, c, z, goes to d. So you can get it and count it, so it's a, a i plus b, j plus c, k. So after we got a direction, we have to find the actual distance, so the normal should be like that. It goes up to infinity. Now we know the direction already, but we do not know the point of this on the plane, the exact point. But we do know some points, like the x intercept, the y intercept, and the z intercept, which is here. So in this case, we can take random, let's say the x intercept, and it's actually the point s here. So you find the vector from p to s, and project it onto here, into the real, the real, this, the real vector. So you project this into this. So by finding the actual distance, the formula will be P, the vector of ps dot n over the magnitude of n modulus. So this is actually the scalar component of ps onto n. So I'll give a minute for you to think about this and I'll pass the next example to Jason Wong. Hi, I'm Jason. So after Jeremy had explained to you the concept of finding the distance between a point and a plane. So now let's try an example. Okay, now how do we find the distance between point P with coordinates 0, 1, 1 and the plane, between the plane 4y plus 3z equals to negative 12. Okay, so now first you have to draw the plane. Okay, so let's say point P is here. Okay, so when we want to find the distance, we're talking about the distance which is of P from the particular down to the plane. Okay, so which is this? Okay, this is the distance. So now we have to find the direction of P pointing to the plane. Okay, so to find the direction, we can find it with the normal of the plane. We can get the normal from the equation of the plane. Okay, so from the equation, we can say the normal is 4j plus 3k. Right? Okay, so now after we found the normal, we have to find any point on the plane so that we can find the distance. Okay, so let's say point S. Okay, so to find the point, we, the easiest way is we use the intercepts. Okay, so let's say we use uh, the y intercept. Okay, 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 so at the y intercept, x equals to zero and z equals to zero, right? Okay, so now we substitute both of these values into the equation of the plane. So we'll get 4y plus 3, 0 equals to negative 12, which makes y equals to negative 3, right? So now let's say we put point S here, right? Okay, so the coordinates of point S will be from what we've calculated is 0, negative 3, and 0. Okay, so now we have we connect P and S together. Okay, so now we have to find the vector of P S. Okay, so to find that, okay, the vector of P S will be the coordinates of S minus the coordinates of P. So it's zero minus zero i plus negative three minus one j plus zero minus one k. Okay, which gives you negative 4j minus k, right? Okay, so now, what we have to do now is we have to project the vector ps to the normal, okay? So we can find the distance, okay? So now, we have to project it, so the distance will equal to ps dot the normal over the length of the normal. So the distance we're finding is the positive component, right? So we have to have a modulus over here. Okay, so 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 P 
Ps is negative 4j minus k dot n, the normal, 4j plus 3k, right? Okay, over the distance, the length of the normal, which is the square root of 4 squared plus 3 squared. Okay, so what we get from here is we get 16, negative 16 minus 3 over 25. Right, so which means we get negative 19 over 5. Because of the modulus, so the distance from P, point P to the plane is 19 over 5. Okay. Thank you. I got the magic in me. Every time my took that track, it turns into gold. Everybody knows.